Hey now, stop rocking. All right, y'all. Welcome back to my kitchen. What we have here is a failure to communicate. No, wait a minute. That's all right. What we have here are leftovers from the other night. There's some hash browns in there. From the night before that, I actually had some bacon left over. Don't know how I had bacon left over, but I found it this morning. So uh, then we have a couple of cackleberries and some cheese. Over here I've got some uh, my hot pepper relish and some ambrosia. So uh, first things first, I'm going to take the bacon and the hash browns. And I'm going to put them over in the toaster oven and let them get started. Alright, now I've always been told room temperature eggs and break them in a separate container. Because if one's bad, you don't want them ruining everything else. So, there's one. And these are store-bought eggs. These aren't what I usually use. I usually get the ones from my neighbor. But, hey, it is what it is. We'll put that one in there like so. And then we'll get this one. That goes in there like that. I'm pretty sure I got these at the dollar store. They're 18 eggs for a dollar. They're itty bitty eggs. So, uh, I add about a teaspoon or so of water per egg. Like that. Put that aside. I still haven't cleaned up from cooking last night. So, my kitchen is really a mess. We'll throw in a little bit of sriracha. Like so. I ought to have a pan over here warming up, shouldn't I? I should, I should. Crank that up there like that. Now, generally, well, my, it broke. I hope I can fix that. Um, generally, I use a stick blender. I don't know where it's at. I ain't nothing to use. I really, really, really do not like the white of eggs. So, and then when Waffle House makes eggs, they use a a uh, milkshake maker and blend that, blend them up, and it really makes some frothy, whipped up eggs. So, it's pretty much what I'm going to try to do here. Take that and get it fixed. Now I'm going to take a little bit of this ambrosia. First we'll get some of this pepper stuff. Let's turn around over here. Here we go, here we go. The belly show. Oh, Alright, now. Here we go on my little pan. We'll throw in some peppers and onions, like that, oh yeah, oh man, that smells good, hmm, oh, that will light up your sinuses in the morning, we'll give that a chance to start doing its thing, and turn down that heat way down because I don't use heat when I I don't use a lot of heat when I cook my eggs get that going like so and we'll take that out of there add in the egg 
and right away add in some cheese now I turn that heat way down I'm about three and a half on my electric stove I'm gonna give that just a minute oh man see when you're hairy you have to be careful yeah that's all right y'all ain't eating it turn that handle around here so I can hold it start breaking up that cheese and breaking up that curd a little bit we're cooking them eggs low and slow oh yeah man mm 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 Well, them two eggs made a lot of egg, didn't they? Oh, yeah. That cheese is getting all melty in there. Nice soft curd. Mmm. Maybe you don't like little soft, creamy curds in your scrambled eggs. That's fine. I mean, I've had, a, I've, I eat scrambled eggs when they're quick cooked and, you know, the big curds and all. I'm not as happy about it. Anyway. I'm going to shut off here. Uh, this has got probably another three, four minutes. And you all really don't want to sit here and watch that now, do you? Nope, I know you don't. So, anyway, back in a little bit. All right, folks, we're back. Would you look at how soft and creamy that, that is? Oh, man, I love it like that. I'm going to turn that heat off. Let them sit there and finish for a minute or two. Mm -mm -mm. Alright. See that? They're all nice and finished now. Here we go. We got the belly show. And whoop, we're back to the plate. All right. Get that in frame. Stop rocking. Okay. I like my little improvised tripod, but sometimes it's got to do the shake. Now that's a brunch. Mm-hmm. Yep. Eggs. Some hash browns. Some bacon. Yeah, buddy. That's going to be mm -mm, tasty. So anyway, I want to thank you all for stopping by and checking out my kitchen. Checking out my leftovers. My breakfast brunch. So, uh, yeah. I really do appreciate you all. See you next time.